Welcome to Operation Tarantula Hawk. This is going to be a quick brief, just a quick overview of what we're doing. Um, we're going to be concentrating on the southern blue route. The first checkpoint is in Kilo 65. Silas is going to be heading directly there and capturing that point and then laying down a fob. Our next objective is going to be the gas station in India 62, approximate. Uh, the airborne squad is going to be primarily tasked with that, and he's going to be moving up the river. And then uh, NSA spy squad, squad three, is going to be working the north side of the river as a screening force from the uh, northern edge of the map border to wherever the uh, infantry fighting vehicle, the bulldog is. Bulldog is going to be roughly uh, positioned on the north side of the road, north side of the river, so that it can be a, a uh, suppressive uh, fire support for our uh, final ascension onto the gas station. So basically, all three squads that are not a vehicle squad are going to be forming a rough platoon line north to south. Uh, the idea is not to let the INS sweep behind us. They do get some forward spawns. The forward spawns are marked in India 5-4 for the helmet, and then a course in a mosque area, which I'll mark right now with another helmet. So expect contact within two to three minutes out of live. Um, the idea is we don't want we don't need to rush anything. So we're going to use our overwhelming fire superiority. In the in the uh, in the grenade launchers in which we have, we have some range with those. We also have plenty of MGs. We got ammo bearers. We've got FTLs with ammo, you know, bags on them, and we also have the the bulldog, which has ammo on it. So, get out of here. Oh, hey, we're live we're with round one of we're Operation up. Tarantula Hawk. Our quitting country Good luck, guys. Let's Any go, infantry boys. restrictions crossing water. You know, there's enough British subjects uh in the operation that it doesn't you know it's not entirely out of the I mean, realm of reason uh out of the realm of reason that uh there's enough british patriotism going on everyone else though is just running uh platoon formation is uh I guess this is the tentacle blob. No big deal because they're really in not a lot of uh they're not they're not really in a lot of danger here. I mean, really. Take a, we're going to go move over to the first location while we do that. We're seeing two squads move out on the north side. Uh, Commander Dorf is here, right in the middle, right along the uh, the main river bed, um, and it looks like Squad Three has a fire team deployed forward. They're going to get the first eyes here. Remember to delete your marks. They're going to have eyes on the uh, position, the first objective at K six five four. For the British, looks like one squad's already across, one squad's gonna probably push towards this bridge and then hit across. Squad 3, looks like it's gonna begin screening. And then Squad 4, uh, is small. It's in the, uh... I'm hearing noise, like, in my, uh, in my headset. Oh, man. I'm not entirely sure what's going on. I had a, uh, relative, uh... I mean, I didn't have a really quiet place where I used to be. I, I moved house this week. So... Into a little bit more... Into more of a temporary situation. But, you know, it's whatever. But, in the grand scheme of things... I could stop... Like, I could, you know, generally believe that I had some sort of control over the the noise, the noise in the mic and stuff. But yes. anyway, it doesn't matter. That's you. just all whatever. Much, so I gotta let you guys go. British forces. Yeah, we actually do get in trouble. trouble but... Really getting close here. Let's go up north and see what the uh, forward squad is doing here. First location. Paint location secured. 
And that is the initial location done. Oh, I thought I had the... Oh, whoops. There we go. I'm going to hold my position until that bulldog is closer. Copy, dude. Yeah, my bad. We were having some complications. Lord. I don't see any movement in the west. There you go. Alright, copy. Three, three, go ahead and proceed about 300 meters to Got an expert on the radio here. India 65 means this is Pony and Lad running up. We get away from the uh, from the bulldog here. This is Pony. Best Pony and Lad are uh, on the southern map border. All right, we're moving up now. With the contact spotted, looks like these guys are just right, two, probing. Where you're probably going to get engaged in about 100 meters. We're just going to hold there until. Uh, Maybe these guys are just here to, uh, sneak, try to sneak their way past and sneak their way around. Although, with these guys being spotted, British are going to be deploying some troops here to, uh, stop them. And these troops are going to be UJ Key. Pony's gone prone here. Oh, and Contact in the riverbed, approximately 150 meters from INS the forces west. looks like Silent and Bags here in the riverbed Roger. have some eyes straight to their east, and they've started to fire. Contacts marked by red smoke. Squad three, I need you to move fire team. Seven. And there's a smoke marker in the distance, giving the direction. Oh, I heard a uh, explosion. Looks like grenades. They're trying to shoot grenades towards, uh, Silent and company here. You can see some rounds right bounce up. Can that move up a little bit? And here we go. Yeah, Roger. INS forces engaging at range. You can see the- you can hear the rounds bouncing off pretty close here. Sign this squad. Uh, this was the hideout squad. They started opening up. Lots of AKs forward here. Contacts approximately I six six six. India six 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 getting called out on the radio. Let's take a look at the, to the north here. Storm's got himself some binox. He's trying to find targets for, and they are to engage, no doubt. Even though I was right next to him, waiting for British forces to start peeking around, and uh, they're getting close. Uh, I think these guys are trying to climb the. Yeah, these guys are trying to climb that uh, stone fence in the side there. I heard a lat or something. Maybe there was a GL at distance. Contacts are going to gas station as well. And British command now realizing that uh, the insurgents are exactly where they wanted to be. Copy that. Now I do believe some of the colors have changed. Um, I believe the. The text on the screen changed as a result of the last patch that released yesterday. The color of the text. I could be wrong, but I just want to say the blue looks a little bit different. Maybe the uh, the red is also more red now, but there have been a little bit of tweaks to the game as a result of yesterday. Spy, is that like your northern element 
Also, the... Middle. Not the respawn mechanics, which we don't use. Just the main large part of what changed. Uh, taking a look at... The British push here. Fire team way in the north. It's going to run into an entire squad, and that's bad. A uh, fire team in the south is about ready to turn into a fire team. Now, Mighty has got his guys spread out all along here. Oh, look at that. There's an IED. Let's take a look at this thing. Map looks updated. Now let's see what this ID is. I should be able to... I mean... It's behind me, so it must be in this building? Dude, let me know if you need some... Let's see... Let me see if I can find this real quick. I'm not going to spend too much more time on it, but... Ah, oh, there it is. Well, is there any way that you can have a fire team just hold the south and then help two out with some suppression on Moscow? Yeah, we're currently engaging the Moz pretty heavily. We got a squad jammed up there. And uh, NSA is actually... There, maybe they're going to swing so north and try to recombine their fire team uh, here. Uh, two to one. Or maybe two this is just holding. I'm not entirely sure. Two, two. Lots of shots at a distance oh, here, but no casualties from either right side yet. Bulldog is moving up a little bit. It's going to move closer. Where did we take that contact? The Bulldogs got himself a little bit closer here. He's just poking holes in windows at this point. There's a lot more fire going on over here. It looks like Pony and Lad got spotted by a, the British force. Oh, they have a fire team pinned. Some of these rounds have gotten real close. Pony and Lad, really great job of... Uh, Really great job Four mags left. of stopping an entire British squad by themselves. Maybe with a little bit of supporting fire, but it's still impressive, you gotta say. I'll, I'll hold this stick. Yeah, you did, Scott, so you guys move back, at, back south, cover our flank. Me and Scott, you moving south. Scott, Scott, on me. Yep, moving south. You, JK, gonna. Bring some folks with yes. them, and this is going to be a great way to get a little closer here, because Pony and Lad probably won't be able to tell that they're here until all right or right, right close, and Pony is just hiding behind a small tree. Here we go. Uh, let's take a look at positions here across the map. We've got... Sloth, or not sorry, that's not Sloth up there, that's uh, not an NSA spy. Slowly bringing his forces in together. Looks like we also have mines on the road. In uh, India 545, India 674. No mines in the south. And here is the, uh, the bulldog. Let's take a look at uh, some British positions here, just to see what they're doing right now. Yeah, Pony and Lad are... Pony looks like... Pony might be moving back here. Whoa! Still no casualties for either side. Silas overestimating the force. Squad size, 
That was just two people. And Pony and Lad are running away. Can they only use one vehicle? That's affirmative. British only have the Bulldog to work with for this operation. And, uh, here we go. Sloth. Sloth in the gunner's seat here. With Koi driving the Bulldog. Sloth finding some more windows to uh, engage with. Take a look at some of the forces in the north here. They're taking contact from. We are to clear out the uh, those two compounds and push to the west. Suppressing. Command is moving with NSA spy. He's got a. He's got two. He's got like a squad and a half in front of him with one squad, and they're still pretty spread out. But they haven't moved in about five minutes. And look at this. They have this. They have this road locked down. INS does. It's going to be really bad news if the British decide to push through here. As long as the British just hold position and decide not to get it. Oh my. Say and set. Command, I'm currently down to two full uh, rounds want to go. with uh, one half. You want to move to that north? On the Bulldog. Right, yes, we're just at, uh... Bulldog going through a lot of ammo here. As the British are moving up, they're closing in with about 100, dis 100 meters of the uh, the compound they're going to have to take on their way to the gas station. Now, with the British moving closer, this is two squads pushing into one. And there are some support positions here for INS, but... I can't see one. I don't see one. With, the, with this squad locked in here in this compound, I wonder if they're going to try to retreat. Pony and Lad still supporting in the south Set here. Scott, doing well. I'm gonna move up a little bit. So just so I can watch this death light. UJ key crawling between cover. Attempting to really get the uh, eyes on here. Copy. UJ Key rounds really falling around him. Uh, looks like one kill for INS now. So the first oh, blood did. goes to INS. getting uh there's an entire squad on this wall here and they're posted up more suppression going on the bulldog trying to add it in too let's take a look at the uh, INS position inside and they're just holding right now the bulldog is giving them plenty to think about about looking out the uh, the window here we got Soviet doge with his uh, FAL What else we got around here? Fertilizer. I got a fire team pushing Moss now. Oh, and here comes GL Smokes. A fire team came across. There's a hole in the wall to our right. We could breach from the right. GL Smoke uh, seems to be relatively effective covering them up. But also these all these high walls here. There's really one place for them to come out, and that's right here. Does anyone have eyes on this? It doesn't appear to be. The British are getting real close to this compound. Willem, whatever you're about to do, do it with your side. You have the wrong kit. Yeah, he is far. He's like two Viper and UJ Key just chilling. Viper, the AR. Yeah, I, I, I don't think that's me. Whoa, INS, big moves here. 
They've fallen back Dude, off mosque. Two guys up here. Unusual position. Huh? And the British are now inside the mosque Your area. Is like mounted so it looks like <laughs> yeah. All right. Squad so three is oh, falling back. So He's beginning to fall back to the radio. All right, be slow. There's those two shooters yeah. at least down that ridge. Well, I think uh, there's more definitely... in that compound south of Moss. Yeah, definitely. Ooh, Pony got ended. Three, this They've got four. people on the map. Go ahead, Slot. Uh, where, where are you taking contact from so I can- Pony got shot. I guess he got shot from the mosque. I don't think he, um... I don't think he expected... Are you talking to me? In the north? Anyone yeah. to be at mosque. Maybe you got a little tunnel vision? Hard to tell. At I six, seven, eight. It's not a huge force, Lad falls back, losing his buddy. Falls back to, uh... Right. Jet Razor here, and Jet Razor is gonna hold this angle. This is a dirty angle, man. You can always, uh, you can always bet that any force moving along this, uh, moving in this direction, moving along this side of the map, is gonna be using this map border area. All right, let's move up the bulldog a little. INS forces continuously. Whoa, smokes. Three, we're moving the bulldog to assist you. More GL smokes now. Impressive. Impressive use of GL smokes, really. One kill for INS, one kill for British. Very, uh, very methodical operation here. Lots of firing at range. Lots of suppression going on. The, um... The Hesco's here. Oh, take a look at that. That's a genius sandbag placement on top of the Hasco. And Imanaz can just for days peek. He even had a shot on someone. And the Bulldog engaging at range. Three keeping a fire team up right, here in the north, south, keep eyes down and there. looks like uh, Squad Four's infantry place. rolling in with Silas, we got infantry, Squad Three. Uh, They're going to have a squad, about a squad size force gotcha. here to push west, and they want this compound. They want to try to keep, according to their plan, they wanted to try to keep as close to the river as they could. Did you hear a comma cut? I don't know. Did I? Did you? Uh, uh, they're moving towards us now. From the compound, they're attacking north. Copy. Roger, you copy. Hey, uh, they're attacking north. Uh, oh yeah, looks like a little bit of a shift happened for Squad One. They moved out of the uh, the riverbed. Bags and Silent are still there, but the fire team has taken more aggressive positioning along this northern wall. take a look at some of these positions. Mighty the squad leader has his squad completely north of him. Ooh, Pundit's got himself a nice... Liberal Pundit's got himself a nice rooftop here. And... If he's careful, he can get some nice shots here. Looks like Hacky Macky just got killed. Three kills for British, one kill for INS. So maybe Hacky Macky, uh... Ooh, Liberal getting suppressed here. G-Man's hit from a distance. Uh, let's take a look at some more of these INS positions here. We got Storm. The FTL is still looking around for people to shoot. He might actually... He's got a Scorpion. Whoa. Imanaz with a murder hole. He was just scanning the opposite uh, building. Saint you can see St. Obama right, right there. We're just taking fire from our north and our direct west as we try to push this comp. I'm not sure if Karma's playing. I'm, I don't think so. Yeah, I copy that. Silas, would you say it's coming from the field or something? Frederick here with Exoskeleton. Uh, I know Exoskeleton just throwing here. himself into this crack here. 
gives him a crazy, crazy little uh, view through this uh, through this field because it's just elevated enough that he can see people trying to get through the uh, the field. Flamio, or uh, Hotman Flamio, because he's got a comma there. I copy. Go ahead. Uh oh. Yeah, go ahead and start either stay there Sloth and died. Contacts to your west or so I guess Sloth got killed out of the gunner of the, uh... I guess Sloth got killed out of the turret of the Bulldog. Koig, now soloing the Bulldog, is probably just trying to figure out what he's going to do next year. Maybe so Xbit is gonna if you can't have that link up with them. British making significant progress here. Rifle. Smoke's Second adding. Bridge. What is this? Boys. Zeke and I bound it. I have a guy coming in to uh, yep, be go, the driver go. of the tank or the gunner of the tank. We lost. We're set. Whoa, this is risky move forward here for British. Yeah, we cop copy a cop. Copy set. I'm smoking yeah, up the rest of our approach. Do you want to yeah, see the simultaneously yeah. Bravo? We'll have yeah. the, uh, Taking a look on the north real quick, just to get a reset. Lots of everyone moving around here. And it looks like Beware is going to come down and man the, um, man the Bulldog. Meanwhile, British forces really consolidated in the mosque. They want the gas station. But there's a squad plus holding the gas station. Lots of smokes going out now. So this will get the British up closer, then they have to win all these uh, CQC uh, duels here. UJ Key, moving out. Alright, same thing, cover myself, I'll cover you north. India six, seven, and, and a right. I'll tell you one with that. Ooh. No. Nope. I was gonna say, Silent and Bags might have eyes on this, but there's uh, shots in the way, but Dorfus looks like. I saw a round fly in from this direction. Yeah, Dorf is taking shots. Alright, we got an open net. Sure. Cop net, cop. Are you getting the British are really pushing in here. You're heading into contact, so I would suggest next stream, I'm uh, planning the next stream tonight, but we're not sure. I just saw someone die on the uh, team screen there. Three kills British, four kills INS. INS clawing it back now. We're going to follow Silas's fire team on in, but we're going to reset everything real quick. Looks like Airborne Squad is going to start moving. They're going to start moving... Where are they going? They're going south here? Down. Here comes Silas. Silas is just going to go in. Here we go. Ooh, shots close. Shots close. Going in. Go, go, go. They're moving into yeah, the here, compound. Here, this Not is west. crazy. Razor's on this right. top wall. If Razor stood up, he could probably get some kills, but there's so much, he's gonna stand up. He's taking shots at Silas, but no joy, and so, and Razor's gonna run back. Close, west, northwest. Looks like Boxier, uh, wings UJ key. Watch my back, I'm going back. Right oh, wow, look at... I'm wow. Down. No, a grenade kills multiples. Got one. No, a couple of Razor gets back up on the wall. Uh, there's contacts laying in the rocks in India 6 or in the river. This wall right here has stopped everyone dead. Grenades coming out, but the Roger. INS have plenty of positions here to really. This is still round one. Squad three, it's command. Silas's squad really got cut down here, but Silas is still up. Okay, Silas. I'm gonna... Yeah. Uh, okay, he's above me. 
Oh, Razor with the pistol whip on UJ Key. Hey, they're on the roofs of this compound. If I can get someone to watch them for us from the exterior, they're picking my guys off. Roger, I'm going to get to the roof. Roof. Just the contacts on there. Yeah, and just, just Airborne's going to move into the alternate south uh, midpoint here. Although I think the British are committed to the uh, north here. They'll click a GL. Hey, we're going to get killed by these guys on the roof unless someone gets. They're standing right. Yes, command. Grunt and uh, was it Isman? Everybody south towards one. Copy. And here comes three to the rescue. One's literally right above me. I mean, trying, it's I'm pretty literal. Yeah, you can move however Copy. you need to. Three's moving southwest. And here comes three. Gonna break off from the north here. Looks like a lot of maneuvering going on here. Jack 800 squad ready and is ready and just they're... If they're not gonna kill these guys crossing the road here. Looks like we're seeing some forward movement. They're gonna move. start moving west. Right, Silas, if you uh oh, Storm Imanaz running up on three here. All right. We we can't. We don't have it secure, and they're just picking us off from these roofs. From did they see these guys cross the river? No, they're directly. Storm might have eyes on uh, Chicken. Chicken is looking this way. All right, Ford, oh. Can you get that goddamn bulldog to shoot the fucking roofs of one? Storm goes back to his binox. Oh, yeah, I think he just saw a chicken. Cavola and chicken Keviola. All right. And Storm is Storm is on the hunt here as Keviola and chicken make it into the field. Oh no, casualties in the south. Airborne looks like a frag went off down there. Yeah, it looks like a frag or a rocket went off down there and multiple casualties. Uh, British contact, now like losing away. it. 14 kills for INS, 8 kills for British. The Bulldog has come up and is attempting to cover. Hey, this is new SL for two. What do you want us doing down here? Two, Silas three, is by three, himself three. now. Copy. He's got the radio contact. down. So now it's up to INS. To clear the radio? With two radios down, the British could move through, but I think the British are going to have to finish clearing this compound. Because there are INS forces in it. I think they cleared yeah. Smoke Whoa. here. All right, copy that one. Soviet Doge. Have your guys take a look to see if just holding this door like a boss. I got one cron in the building that I'm directly on. APA. With a GL. Crawls back. Some shots being taken at Appa as he crawls past. Um, might have been from Sevi. And Falcon 3 has a medikit. Inside the compound. Left They're taking right shots at me. You're at 25%. I know. Uh oh. Know. They think that's safe, but. Kill me here while I'm that's not entirely safe. Hey, SL1, there's someone on your roof. Appa, can you. Can you please? Command, uh, the Bulldog is low on ammo. Oh, Razor just got killed. I think. Yeah, Razor's dead. Okay, Woof. Have the bulldog. Just, uh, rearm everybody. Silas still healing. Still, still, still healing. Still hanging out here. And Isman's still up here. Roger, I have three him moving around. He's cross east. And three is in pursuit of... Two is in pursuit of three here in the north. INS squad is just closing in behind them, seeing some smokes here. Don't get shot, knee holes and Maverick here. The NSA spy trying to get his guys motivated to get out of there. INS are just in pursuit now. They're running. They were running, now they're prone. <laughs> Looks like they may be receiving fire. Lots of smoke here, so... I guess this is like GL panic smoke. Ooh, uh, and GL goes out here from Neils. Neils actually hits Potato as he moved across. But look at this. 
Jack is just getting his guys into aggressive mode here. And this is bad news. British are now going to fall back to the Bulldog. And maybe they're just going to go ahead across. There's contacts open in the re open fields in India 7. Let's get some G set up. Let's get these guys when they're running away. Uh, the INS have fall fallen off gas station. And Silas... Uh, Possible audio and contact still on the northern side of the compound. Silas hears, uh, looks like, uh, he hears Lord Chanka, maybe, and Lord Chanka now crossing the street. Oh, man. Yeah, Command, I put an AR right next to you, if you have eyes on him. INS continuously moving away. Check out the direct west. Watch it, they're in the buildings to my north and south. I thought I saw it moving on the north side of the compound. Copy, copy. Watching north. No, it's breaching here, guys. Move, move together. I've got your north up. Fight Shit, milk. Take contact from south still. Squad okay. two was meant to be clearing these guys out, but they're still hanging here, and they have a perfect position to shoot on I'm, anyone I'm trying to come inside this uh, gas station they're compound. British forces now behind the push. Ooh, Bybee. Come out here, someone inside the building next to me. It almost yeah, looked like he building. hit Soviet Doge, but... If we got breacher charges, nah. this is a good time. Yeah, Silas call it for breacher charges. Uh, no, no D-Leak's actually made his way up too. D-Leak has a great uh, position here. And take a look at the position now. Uh, Janko 800 squad, still in the north, is going to move hey, themselves man, around. Get, Just been see, chilling in the riverbed here for a see, while. Get some eyes and get some bells. Rip stream. Command, do you want that vehicle to travel south to three? And then huh? I can help stream with, uh, still looks up to me. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not worried about the compound. I, I, just want, uh, I just want the bulldog up here so we can rearm off of it. I drop for a minute, but it's back. Three's Bravo team is taking fire from the southwest. We are setting up to engage it. Oh, sorry about that, if that's the case. A little reset here. Jackal 800 still moving along the north side of everything. Contact I-755. And the British are now super concentrated around the mosque and the gas station area. Yeah, Commander, they are taking contact from the... the 11 kills for British, 15 kills for INS. Still very that. doable for British to continue on. Here comes the Bulldog. Doesn't appear to have been hit yet, but I know the Bulldog spent a lot of ammo here. Back up a little bit. Right, let's go Oh, does Beware have eyes on Dorf? Ooh. Dorf peeked his head up here, but I don't think the Bulldog Gunner saw it. Hey Cypher, I appreciate it. I hope you're learning Dude. something about the game. Way too much ammo. Command, we are yeah. currently being about flanked that. from the north northwest of our position. We're taking fire. You know, I might play. I usually don't. I've done this in the past. We'll talk about this in a second. Might talk a little bit more between rounds, but I have done in the past is stream playing on the ground. The problem with this is, I get salty. I get real salty, guys. Um, I have attempted to squad lead from while uh, while streaming too, right, hold, hold and that's just a shame. Happen. I'm never doing that again. Might be more west of that, but, but I'm not positive. I don't see anything. I'm currently disabled all spectator cameras on the map. I wish. Um, 
Matter of fact, if you guys, I mean, there's really two things that need to change in the OWI uh, streaming or the OWI spectator camera. First is the, the cameras. The, these guys up here, that's just the thing that's there. The other part is if I hit seven, I can't um, bring up outlines anymore. Do, I don't. I don't even see. I see some outlines, but it's because they're behind an environment wall. But these guys aren't behind an environment wall, and even other teams don't show up in the outlines. So you know, I have to turn them off. Like when we I um. It's just one of them things. I'm blind as a bat. I mean, yeah, DB Scoo. I know I'm blind, but come on, man. Still got no movement to the south. Don't talk to me like that. Northeast, contact northeast. They're flanking us. They're fucking flanking us. Oh, Doobie Scoo gets eyes hey, on Jack 800's hey, squad. He sends a fire team across, and they've crossed over here at Juliet 6 4. They're gonna come around our ass. Oh, I see one. And great reactions here. A nice call out by Doobie Scoo, Lee, and a fire team. And now Chicken over here with his AR begins suppressing. We'll take a look at these uh, INS. These INS are actually ha actually have a uh, sizable wall and hill in front of them. So, I mean, they're safe. We got Mr. GG Redibus here, along with Modern Death. Um, they're just holding position because I think they're just getting shot at right now, but... If they just keep going, it could turn out really well for them. And the Bulldog has actually turned around too, and this is the bad news. Yeah. The Bulldog turns and puts its far um, front armor in front- our front armor to the east. So, let's see here. Oh, Xbit died. In that, uh, in that fire storm there. Ooh. I hate when that gets bugged. The fire team is still- is gonna push a little bit further east because if they come up on this road, uh, Beware is just gonna light them up. Jack has a squad over here. No lat. Um, as part of this group. Oh, there's Bartok. Bartok is now moving across. Redibus holding the angle for Bartok to cross. So Bartok, uh, yeah, he's running straight for this guy. He's running straight for the Bulldog. Yep, here comes AT. Oh my, and the Bulldog's just going straight up. Gunner not looking. Oh. Uh, Bartok gets a rocket off, but it hits the front armor, and that's a heavily front armored vehicle. So now Bartok is sort of... He's trying to... He's trying to hit the gunner out. That was real close. Real close again. He's in the right area. The gunner is still looking. Koig and Beware, get out! They're gonna hunt down Bartok! Koig gets destroyed, and there goes Beware. As Jacko 800 sends a fire team across right at the right moment, and the Bulldog is abandoned and gone. Oh, it got tracked! No, it didn't get tracked. That's just a body. Uh. So the Bulldog is gone. The Bulldog is out of commission now. So yeah, three and four, don't take that southern road. Go through the but the British are going to push through. Looks like they're just continuing to push along. They have the radio set behind them. The two radios are still up. So the British, maybe they're just trying to push through. Um, as far as the last objective, the radio tower, there's two fire team. There's two buddies right here. Jet Razor and Lad. These guys are just chilling at the radio tower. 
Mighty has some folks along the more southern route of advance. Sebi holding four guys, including himself, real close to um, enemy contact here. Here they are. Uh, this is the Sebi, Sebi squad here. Sebi just got hit, but it looks like he uh, three, three, dropped nine, saying nine, Obama nine, nine, first. North and west. Sebi bandaging. Yeah, it looks like he's okay. Yeah, we're taking contact from south, southwest over here. Heard. Copy that too. Alright. We can try to punch it northwest if you think the train looks better. Oh, some people don't know what 07 is. It's like a salute, you know? ASCII art, man. Before emojis were cool, there was ASCII art. He's been told, he's told us like three times not to go there. Careful, Doobie. Careful, Doobie. British trying to yeah, circumvent yeah, this compound. Those, uh, eye holes. Oh, okay. I'm going to the Shit, did Silas go down? I need a medic. I'm oh. Infantry and... Oh, I... Don't get shot shooting behind him. He actually tags right. Modern Death here as you US right? forces... Or, no, sorry. Get INS forces up. actually, um... <laughs> Before emojis were cool, what are you talking about? Oh man. Looking. I mean, that's that's a fair point, Scrooby, but still. Maverick, don't get shot. Just looking behind. INS forces, this is Jack's squad, still relatively intact here. They're continuously pushing through. British making some significant progress, but... They still got it from the east. So that means Neholes, Maverick, and Donkachat are going to have to move real fast here to get out of the way. I'm not sure what the, uh... Man, I wish I knew what the deal was with the stream. I'm on a new... I'm on a new... I'm on a new internet connection, so... Yeah, those are mine. Alright. Are those, all those guys yours? Let's keep moving west. I'm not getting any reports that it's that uh, I'm dropping uh, frames, uh, so it must be a uh, internet okay, traffic so thing. Gonna but gonna even south, then, and we're gonna try and take the compound at I-754 from the west now. It could be a bunch and of things. That works. Um, we're kind of getting the last. We're taking the last contact from there. Uh, yeah, I'm hit once though. Yeah, so I could choose some. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Guess you, but no, 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 you're right. If, listen, Is that Muff? Muff? Definitely hit Duncan shot. Yeah, yeah so. We had to crawl up oh, they're, they're running the really area. hard here. Maybe it wasn't Muff. Maybe Muff was a camera, but Bags just got shot by Caviola. Dorfin's silent here. Okay, we gotta keep going west. Um... So we need to, for sure, push through. We're going to the last objective, so we're avoiding this one and just going to the one that's hopefully undefended. Two is almost there. We need to reinforce them. A little update from none as NSA spy. Yeah, we push north. No spy. There's contacts. Dorf uh, has is looking in the right direction, but he's got a little bit of defile. There's a little bit of foliage between him and NSA spy's little semi fire team here. Uh, taking a look at what's going on here. Let me hide this chat. The... So we're just... Are we just going to cross right now? There's still we're about, uh, 400 can, meters for two to, 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 for two to, to clear river. here, and they got a that fire team between there, so... Just go around the side and get up with two. Chicken, um, go ahead and take us out. U.S. forces still pushing through. Go, yeah. Looks like Nihols just died as, uh, maybe from Imanaz? Maverick. Yeah, I'm willing to say Imanaz made that shot from there. Absolutely. I could be wrong, though. I've been wrong before. All right, we need to fucking get out. YouTube gets affected as well? Okay. Are you good? Are you bleeding? You, yeah, bandaging myself the right now. Moving to you. Copy. We're gonna take the river. And try and get a line with you. We can attack the last compound. Copy. Alright, uh, this makes quick. We gotta go north. Keep cover to your east, because they're coming from over there as well. 
Copy. Are you ready? Ooh. Yep. What a shot. Let's do it. Someone gets shot inside, uh... Hey, or close to... Contact, close to so. Mighty over there. Woof. British forces. Oh, looks like uh, Dwarf pushed across. That may not be good. Uh, where are these guys? They're over here. I'm right behind you. Dwarf pushed across and not an NSA spy's fire team. I'm getting shot. Southeast, southeast, not sure southeast, from southeast, where. Southeast, yeah, southeast, really close. Southeast. Oh, look at that. Yep. Silent kills, not an NSA spy. Silent kills. Uh, Keviola, and now it's just chicken here. And Silent just chilling. Wow, he's even got his bipod deployed and everything. I need- I don't have the YouTube stuff pulled up. I'll figure that out, um, uh, who's in between command? rounds. I just forgot to pull it up for today. Command, this is three. Okay. Uh, we're three effective. If you're safely able to, last thing Command said was to move west along the river and try to get into a line with me. We're moving to G857 to the final objective. Get and don't get shot in Maverick behind. Negative. Okay, well, there's a guy direct to our south. He's like direct 150 and, and like 15 meters away. Uh oh. Do, can you, do you have uh, command comms? INS yeah, have taken the right, second, have taken the uh, gas station, yep. which means right, okay, it, the British have to go back right. and recapture gas station. Uh, NSA spies dead. Oh, wait. And there goes, don't get shot. That was a weird, like, red flash there. Uh, chicken and silent. Does that mean they have to move back to the previous objective? Ooh. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. Sound like doing work there. The British are now going to have to move back to gas station. And the main British force is in the middle of a field right now. They have to push through a squad worth of people. Oh my gosh, what is that? Oddball's just running into the field. He kills Doobie Scoo. Gets Garrett. Wow. What an absolute unit. I think Imanaz is close here too. Imanaz running towards this field to try to help clear it. Bartok also in it, and Modern Death is also in it to the east. Oddball repositions himself on the western side. We're getting close to the, the round here. 33 kills for INS, 16 kills for British. A great effort here by British, but... I don't know if the, it was just too slow. They never really ended up dealing with that contact in the north, too. Oddball is just clearing out here. I definitely shot a lot of bullets towards what looked like a turban, so I got that going for me. Oh, and Falcon's going to heal That's Fight Milk here, so if Bartok sees these legs move, off. Modern Death running this way, too. I'm crawling around out here. comes Crawling Move. Fight Milk kills Bartok, but gets hit in, this me in the meantime. Here comes Oddball. Clears up, uh, Fight Milk and his medic buddy. And... I think that's actually GG. Yep, that is GG. Round one goes to INS. It's a great effort there. We will be right back with round two of Operation Tarantula Hawk here in Squad Ops. Both right, chats now. Here. Oh, here we go. We're going to be live in about four minutes, so we'll get, make this quick. Good job last round, everyone. That was fantastic work. Everyone everyone played a part. Literally everyone played a part in that. Um, we fucking stopped them cold, and we boxed them up and flanked them real good. So this round, we're going to be a little more pointed than they were. So we're going to take northern route instead. Uh, we've, we're going to lay our fob down in Juliet 5-6. It's going to be my job. Then we're going to try and hit police station after police station. The uh, great farm or whatever the fuck that's called. Um, how we're going to do that, we've got squad, uh, jack squad, squad two will be in the north. along Pretty much riding the map border area. Cruising through the uh, area where there's known insurgent activity. Marked by that rally mark. 
Uh, Oddball Squad with the Bulldog will be riding through the middle, roughly here, and just be going this way. The Bulldog will support the north or the south or himself as necessary. And then uh, Sebi Squad will be on the Marksman Mark. They're just going to drift west themselves. They're likely going to experience contact coming from uh, this. It'll So they'll probably be caught in some kind of crossfire, so they'll have to be mindful of that. And then finally, Mighty Squad will be split around the IED marks. The marks aren't exact, but they'll be somewhere in that general vicinity. They're going to be watching our flank, making sure that they don't do to us what Jack did to them and Jack Squad did to them. So our rear security is very important in this one, boys. So let's maintain 360 at all times. Uh, let's utilize Karma's favorite word, aggression. Let's just fucking hit them hard. Huh? I thought it was micro terrain, but aggression word. Uh, that's probably his new word, but... <laughs> what is Karma? <laughs> aggression, aggression, aggression? You, you know yep, Karma? Right. Oh boy. Alright. Nice meme. Right, boys, and here we go, live. Oh, these guys are moving straight out. That is... Hmm, I wonder... I want our team to get to the end of the road, so I expect great things from all of you. Yes, sir. Uh, so we're closing in about 150, 200 meters away from contact right now. Oh, maybe a little bit further than that, maybe about 300 right now. But, um, they're just moving along the map border. They're going to try to get to J425, this wall right here. Um, faster than Jack 800 will, but it looks like... Oh, they're prone and they're moving forward. So this is meant to be... The British are just moving at a breakneck pace right now. Having to cross the bridge, uh, just south of one. Yep. But these guys are trying to sneak it around. The spacing leaves a little bit to be desired, but the British are moving pretty fast here. Jack Wayne Hunter leading his squad forward in a uh, column. It's more like a file. They're just leaping over everything. They're gonna go crying back to their and Jack's smart Michael enough, enough to, to stop here and look I around, but everyone here is prone, so he's not gonna see anyone until they come around the corner. And Hotman, nope, they're gonna come up and over. Uh, are these guys gonna have eyes on anything? Maybe you, J. Key. But I Pop doubt up. it. Pop up. Yeah. Oh man. Pop up, can I get always valid? Yay. They're gonna hear this. Oh my gosh. Thank you. Look at this. Everyone went prone here on British. I think Jack is hearing people crawl around. I don't have nades. Someone throw nades. nades. Here comes grenades in. Uh, contact west. Jack gets hit. Okay. Grenades coming over. Okay. Not far enough or too far. Silas stands up. Not a cop gets killed. Viper kills Jack and Bartok. No, that was a... And there's a TK. A TK grenade. Looks like a dead nade. What an ambush. Half that squad is dead. Redibus tries to go up and over, but doesn't make it. And looks like there is some supporting fire coming in from the rest of the British team to the south, but Hotman goes down. Celtic Potato and Dev are the last ones. Unfortunate. Dev is going to try to hop over the hop over this thing here, but Silas is just going to put a few rounds into him. That's three rounds into Dev, and Salty Potato's all by himself. Wow. Salty gets to cover, but an entire squad is down. Five kills, two, plus the TKs, so that's seven. That is brutal right there. Casualties from that, seven casualties for British, looks like uh, two casualties for INS. Dude, all the squad two is dead. What the fuck? 
Salty Potato is the only person in Squad 2 that gets away from that. The first objective is complete. Here comes the Bulldog for support. Looks like they're gonna... They're gonna come up and over here. Do these guys... These guys don't have a lap, so... Big shrug. If the if the bulldog just comes up on these guys, they got nothing to fight it back with. We'll take a look at some other British positions here. Uh, looks like uh, two squads or a squad and a half here. Are pushing towards this police station compound right here. And there's only one squad in the north. AT mine goes down in Hotel Five Two Nine. And the lat D leak with uh, snowfall looking to shut down the northern road. Could be bad news if this bulldog decides to push the northern road here. Silas readjusts his squad, and the British now knowing the jig, now knowing what's going on. Ooh, Razor is going to take some shots here. Doesn't see any connect. And now Grunt puts himself on the wall. Razor and Arcardi moving along here. Grunt has the uh, Grunt has that little hole in the wall knocked, knocked down. Razor's going to come around. Is Silas going to be able to see? Oh, Razor's taking a way northern approach here. Salty's running around too. Look at Razor's position here. He's going to have a rear shot on Silas. This is the lead part of this platoon. Here comes a grenade, actually. Goes off right beside Silas. More grenades coming in. But this element now has no leadership. Zeke is getting shot. Harv able to return some fire on the Razor, gets him back down. Contact police. God, Rather Scottish chap gets Mark, shot. The the and here comes here comes smoke yeah, markers. Oh, and the Bulldog is coming around. These guys have got to pull back now. They can't fight the Bulldog. Regardless of what happened, they can't fight the Bulldog. And Lad is going to have... Oh, Zeke gets shot. Looks like maybe Razor got a kill there. Can't see anything, mate. And the Bulldog's got to get out of this ditch. Looks like it might have a chance to sort of squeeze up the... the west side of this ditch here, if it can try to turn. He's trying to turn it up. He's got to be careful with that thing. He doesn't want to get that thing stuck. Meanwhile, British forces continuing to advance in other locations. Rather Scottish chap getting AR'd now by, uh, Grunt. These INS guys don't really have much of a, uh... And now Grunt is just gonna spray here. British Force's massive push, though. They're at the police station already. Appa's dead. It's just Falcon 3 and Fight Milk on the police station. And the British are just gonna make some real progress here. Grenade goes off on the roof. More GLs landing on the roof here. Fight Milk and Falcon. More GLs landing here. Oddball, how's that contact? Uh, we're moving around to isolate them. GLs going off along the, along the roof. Just and... Oh, Chaka gets shot from his south. What a there. shot! Oh, Chaka's dead! Where did that come from? Was that like these guys right here? What a shot! Straight south of me. I'm on you. So they're getting shot from Mosque, where looks like a squad and a half are at Mosque. The other squad is at gas station. I'm covering this window. I'm looking that way right now. The ambush squad able to really pull back here, and it looks like the uh, the bulldog decided it can't get up on this side of the hill here. Not much luck. It's going to go ahead and get back to the road. One AR right here, one on this wall, looking towards the compound. Reacher kit? Question mark. 
Soviet, look here. Maybe? How's it going, Sam? Soviet's still a little closer. Uh, breaching that charge right now. They're oh, yeah. Oh, Ping! Charges went off. Oh, so, um... Fight Milk actually fell back. I missed that. Fight Milk uh, fell back, so one breach of charge waste. But this is technically a midpoint uh, for British, so they could put the radio here. If they clear it, they could put the radio down. I'm gonna cover this entrance. Cool, excellent. We're taking heat from Moscow currently. That's good. That's clear, guys. Are we all clear, Subby? Bulldog still taking shots here at Scottish Chap. And Patrick Star. The only thing saving them is these uh, environment walls. I want to try to move up to two. Four, 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 me one. Oh, the Bulldog's going to right yeah. roll right up on these guys. Now, guys the let's yeah, see. Yeah. There is a let further down this road, unless he fell back. He did fall back. So D-League fell back behind the mine at Hotel 528. I wonder if, uh, I wonder if the, why wouldn't the, uh, why wouldn't it just come down to the south? The Bulldog. Why would the Bulldog take this northern road? Oh, rut row. <laughs> oh! I'd rather Scott's chap kills the gunner. Isman's pulling the bulldog back now. The gunner is down. And I think a rat got his chap just got destroyed here. And Patrick Star running away. That grenade might have been good. No, a little short. Hey, Satchel charge where you are now. There's a building right there. Oh, they're going. Satchel? Gotcha, yeah, oh, they're gonna they think they're in this building really hold up here. Dude, mm, I don't know about that. INS repositioning their forces now. They've withdrawn from the mosque. They're Pull moving back. south, uh west here with one squad. One squad moving straight up north here. Looks like we got an IED placed in Hotel 522. And Hotel 529, that mine is still there. British forces spreading themselves out here. Uh, the Bulldog is, um... Buddy. Spamming. The breaching charge goes off, but no kills there. Patrick Star falls back. And this is where, uh, this is where the Take ambush squad you, started from. Copy. Real awesome work there. Nine kills for British. Um, 11 kills, 11 kills technically. I don't know, 9 kills for British, 9 kills for INS, but there were some TKs from that, um, from that dead nade, I think. Because they technically count as TKs, but... Three, are you I don't think INS got credit for them on the scoreboard. So Patrick Starr is just hiding right now. Is Patrick gonna have a shot on... Is Patrick gonna have a shot on the gunner here? Something tells me no. Might have a shot on Razor. I think Razor may have just spotted him. Razor definitely spotted Patrick Star, and there goes. So Razor gets the kill on Patrick Star, and whoop de doo! That's the ambush squad gone. Great return on investment there for starting that squad forward, though. That's a lot of problems that INS have caused British, but British still. But their force is intact, and no one's flanked around behind them. A squad for a squad plus, as far as INS are concerned. And the British spread themselves out here at the uh, midpoint compound. Oh, they even put a little... Oh, this is interesting. So they're going to put a, a AR right here? Just spam the wall? You can pick... Big question mark. Wow. 
a lot of action really on the front end of this uh this round of the operation is good stuff they have eyes on police station somewhere west west uh, i lost the guy who was on the roof all right just hold your position we'll wait till the north gets cleared out so we can get this uh bulldog uh oh friendly? bulldog bulldog check fire bulldog check fire please yeah we're checking fire we're checking fire we're checking thank you that was close. Beef Baby got uh, almost cut up by the bulldog. That would have been bad. At least the bulldog gunner is, uh... At least the bulldog gunner's on point with his, uh... reactions there. Holding your corner. Even if he's not got his PID down yet. You know, you take a little bit of column A with a little bit of column B. British making some progress in the north. Two, three squads almost online. Or I guess it's more like... It's two and a half squads online here, and... Mighty has a fire team held back to the west here as rear guard. They're making sure no INS are gonna do anything crazy and try to snipe this back, uh, this back fob over here. Got 60 of you guys watching across all the platforms right now. Appreciate your, uh, your viewing time. Take a look at some of the British positions here as everyone gets ready to push east and, or west now. I said west over here. This is east. I'm dumb. Possible contact west of uh, police station in the buildings, H682, was moving southwest. Okay, copy. He's making noises. The city had some eyes on here. I think there's an insurgent in this porta potty. Oh, right. The, uh, the porta potty. I mean, if it's not, if it, I mean, is it really furious if it wasn't fast as well? I mean, it's taking some shots here. Maybe it's some forces in the north that are crossing. I like to think we're doing okay. A little exposed, but you know. Mainly defense here. Wow. All right. Even Oz and Liberal Pundit, even the south here, they're just screening the south as part of a, uh... Once you get far enough, so this fire team is simply existing for rear guard. Liberal and Even Oz are down here to make Hold sure on, no one on. comes up the, uh, the south side. I'm just not, I'm proceeding west. But, uh, not an NSA spy squad here is, uh... Got a great position. Just, Mighty, have your two guys south of the river. Just have them keep oh, sweeping. Personally, right. I'd rather have this keep position like off, here, yeah. or maybe yeah. like yeah. along this bridge, yeah. just to give them more options. This means they're going to take a little while for them to uh, fall back. There's still a mine on the road. And oh my god, the this thing is moving along the road. Let's see this mine here. Yep, there it is. Now, will the driver see this mine? Jenga has eyes up. Um and Oh, it looks like D-Leak, along with Snowfalls, fleeking around the north here. Mark, a scout. Will Jet Razor see this mine? Maybe they've already seen this mine, actually. And they're just trying to approach carefully. Oh, 
Bulldog taking some shots at uh, fight milk here. Looks like maybe Mark even tried to take a lot, take some uh, take an eye up here too. Snowfall and D-Leak are all along the northern map border here, and they could very easily stand up and throw a rocket in the side of this. Oh no! Are they clearing for mines? No, they haven't cleared for mines. Will Isman see it? Oh, goodbye. The Bulldog is tracked. Jet Razor goes down to the Mind Blast. The Bulldog is immobilized, but it's not dead. Tracked both sides. Oh, looks like, um... I hit him. Oh, the rocket... Where's the kaboom? Uh... Sent, I mean... It's not a... It's not a, um... Oh! IED? They spotted the IED, or did they? Or is it going off? So let's see if they. Oh, wow! So they saw the IED through the window and they fell back. On the other side of my wall. On the other side of my. That is nuts. The IED goes off. Razor leading the charge. With the IED gone, they could just really uh, get in there. Yo, uh, all got tracked. Are we able to repair? Yeah. No. Okay. Uh, Pretty sure they can repair the IED. Repairing the or loud. repair the. Uh, This is round two, Dark Lord. We allow repairing now, ready. So, the only person that can repair the Bulldog is Ismin. Because, oh, maybe Jenga can repair it? Does Jenga have a repair kit? I guess engineers have repair kits. So let's see if they can get this guy untracked. Soviet Doge and Burtonizer making cover for the fire team in front of them. Beef Baby and Sebi and the fire team come up in this compound. They start taking fire immediately. Beef Baby almost shooting Sebi in the side. Great move here. They're getting closer. If you want to move up to the wall, try to kill Airborne to Marks. Mark S is uh, right on the other side of the wall here. Razor making some progress, along with Grunt and uh, Salty Potato. INS doing a decent job of falling back. Uh, right now, 10 kills INS, 13 kills British. It's not working for INS, but... I think the numbers are pretty even here. Mark is crawling um, away to the south here. Hey, I think I saw contact two, three, one. My position. Airborne's not looking either. He doesn't hear, but he's gonna see with uh, with Razor or with Grunt opening up. Grunt taking some shots at Garrett here, and Airborne takes down uh, Razor. Grunt is going to crawl, and a grenade. Grenade. 
There goes Salty Potato and Grunt. What a grenade throw. Airborne. Yeah, we lost two. And we lost two guys from... Fuck. Okay. You guys got a little aggressive up. A great stop here by Airborne. Inus able to, uh... Stop the momentum in the north right, here. Two full squads in this fight, so two and three, or one and three rather, it's gonna be on you. Let's take a look at the uh, bulldog. The bulldog's current status is still okay. tracked. Uh, so it looks like the repairs repair didn't take. The vehicle, the vehicle and fight his infantry heading west. Four. And it looks like the uh, the bulldog's gonna have to be abandoned. Dismounting right now, getting full ammo for everybody. The, um, commander here, Dorf, continuously moving. They probably have fortified the final point, or near to the final point. And the real story is they have zero actual fortifications on the final point. I believe the final point's here. Uh, let me just take a look at the deck. Yeah, we're gonna... Where Actually, let's just take a look at the map. Uh, uh, Fox 635. So, uh, yeah. Fox 6 is, like, uh, here. Yeah, Fox 635, so... Ain't anybody there. INS, uh, keeping their entire force in the front here. British are getting closer, though. And there's no flank force that have come around to move out the other two uh, points. So, British... Yeah, across the bridge. That's across the bridge from us. Really just... Uh, some fire here. Uh, looks like Airborne may have been, got, may have been shot at For along with Mark. Around you and west of you is what concerns me the most. Yeah, we're searching it. We're looking for the guys that killed our guys. Uh, let's see. Anything else between here and there? Doesn't appear to be any no, more no, IEDs no, no, or no. mines. Uh, Obviously, no mines aren't really important anymore, but... Go ahead. Doesn't appear to be any mines uh, or IEDs, I just control. said. Oh so my gosh. Can I talk my, today? My fire team that's up there. So, it's at least one SL, possibly. So, I'm assuming there's more guys down there. That's probably where they are, on the bank. So there's just a uh, fire team here in the north. Looks like Oddball is slowly closing in on these guys with only three people. Meanwhile, a fire team's pushing real close to Sloth Boy, and he's got an entire squad near him. Uh, I believe this is Hemp Farm. Man, I can send a fire team towards Hemp Farm and try and help my these fire team. Yeah, and Muff with the GL is uh ooh. Muff sees Sloth kill Sloth. I just killed him. I killed him. G Man runs over to the corner here, and Doobie Scoo is just holding uh this the uh, hemp farm southeast uh corner is actually open. Um for incursion here, and it looks like Doobie is verifying that his squad leader is dead. And Muff is just holding this angle right here. I think Muff saw the barrel. Oh. Oh! Storm, I think, just ended him. I don't think Muff shot. I think that was Storm. Unfortunate. G-Man's gonna fall back, too. British getting some momentum going on here in the uh, central file. Sorry, you, you have contact immediately in front of you, right? Yeah, probably, probably more over there. 25 to 50 meters west. Yeah. We got two killed north. 25 to 50 meters south, west. But uh, we don't see any more. Mm, so a little bit further back. than that. A little misread on the map scale there, really maybe.
Squad one, we killed a couple enemies this way to your southwest. Southwest, guys. Southwest, south is taking. Oh, INS falling out of hemp farm. Watching the upper window. Got the door. Cop. British gonna waste some time here trying to clear it. Watch out for IEDs. No IEDs in this next compound, but they don't know that. Uh, if you're not AR, you're gonna be going through this door, okay? If you're not AR, you're gonna be going through uh -oh. this door. Marked with red smoke. So. Oddball moving across the field. Um. And Airborne, I think now just got the word that he probably should be running away. Jenga saw Mark run across the hole in the wall. And they're running pretty hard here. I wonder if Oddball... Is gonna have shots on these guys. Mm, he's looking this way. Isman shooting. Ooh, Isman actually taking some shots at Airborne. Some rounds are falling over here, but doesn't appear to be really on target. So INS able to fall back, Mark and Airborne, making some progress. Come back up. British continuously making progress here on the uh, central push, even in the south. Although they have a small force, just a fire team, is about ready to run into about a squad's worth of folks, including Xbit. 15 slow, kills for British, 13 kills for INS. One, I just want you to keep drifting west with your squad. Frederick Same is team. visible from here, Chopped along in. with bags, and even oh, these guys are getting shot from the north. I guess Muff is trying to tap these guys. Maybe, the, maybe it's not Muff. In before GLs start coming over. And Kiviola and Hacky Mackie are going to fall back here now that uh, Frederick added some fire on. GL sails pretty far here. That gets NSA Spy to run away. Ooh. So the GLs are actually raining inside the compound. A stray GL could kill, uh, could get some multiple kills here if it just strays a little bit further, but British are actually going to push past these guys in the north. And, um, Xbit and not an SA Spy are going to... Ooh, we, SA Xbit gets shot! Maybe pulling west. Yeah, I think there's... What a shot! Muff! Look at... Yeah, they're pulling away from us now. Was that Muff? I think that's Muff. Yeah, everyone, everyone Muff has eyes his direction. Here comes Smokes. You know, GL takes out Xbit. NSA Spy lives. Doesn't appear to be hurting at all. Whoa. But that's INS Commander down. Again, if I die, Sebi's in command. After Sebi will be uh, Mighty. After Mighty will be whoever's next. Uncle, I guess. Hanky Manky just got killed here. Looks like Mighty in close contact, but... Taking five to the left. Uh, don't know the Frederick's okay. been hit. GL's coming in. Uh, Maverick's left. shooting north. Maybe Maverick, uh... Because they're definitely in that compound in front of three. Maverick falling back. Is uh, Don't Get Shot going to do the same? Don't Get Shot looking for some blood here. Takes a couple shots and then moves out. Imanaz and Liberal Pundit Marla, are still here in the south. Water. Guy enough at the right. Might have some eyes on. Betcha he definitely saw Don't Get Shot move back. Not an NSA spy and Keviola have fallen back off that compound. INS are pretty broken here. And they're still holding the south objective.
So chicken and limbs holding the south objective. Uh, squad one here, music in charge of it, right, the next has actually the next fallen compound. back to the objective area. Squad there's three, there's another the fire team of INS here at this ditch. That is Fox six five. And liberal pundit gets spotted here. Liberal pundit dies. Looks like knee holes. Get himself some nice range there. Where's Ebenaz? Is Ebenaz still up? Yep, and he's behind some pretty hard cover here. INS forces holding the ditch. Getting engaged here. What are you engaged One goes there? down. Uh, uh, Mark on, S, Snowfall, we are airborne, airborne still body. here in the north. Closing in on the final, I guess final minutes of the operation. It depends on how fast British want to move here, but there's really only one more objective. How's it going, Mike? Looks like four is holding back. They're going to reconsolidate okay, and then push north, further, I suppose. Understood. Fire team of Mighty uh, is still pushing towards four. A little bit of momentum, and yeah, it looks like four is going to start pushing off here to the northwest. Chicken and um, the lat unit here. Who was that? That was uh, limbs moving out of their compound. Looks like they're going to take the long way around to support one as British start getting close here. One keep pushing west. Oddball, ooh, Oddball has Binox out. He's looking further. If he comes up this creek, uh, we are Airborne's got his number, I think. RPG spotted in the Great Farm compound. East and Oddball one, spots the RPG I, yeah, at Great Farm. Is been right behind him. He's They're not the clearing this to... north side over he here. Snowfall's not looking south. Snowfall's still not looking south. INS forces in the south, pushing north now. Mm. Ismin's down. Ismin uh, eats an RPG at range. One times GL's getting close. Yo, let's push up this, uh, if music canal. was solid on the outside of that wall, I think it would be here. toast. And British making significant move now. Significant move. Uh, Airborne is going to stand up here. He's going to get some shots in the back of the British elements. Look at all these guys. Great supporting fire here from the British forces. Another RPG overshoots, question mark. I, Acorn goes down. Another G, another GL dies. The British have to be very careful here. I think Snowfall. Oh, Mark S. Alright, I'm moving up to get eyes. I know, okay, never mind. I, I killed him. It, see, his dead body on the right side of that building. Attacked. It kills oh, one. Yeah, right, we go for it. Smoke Airborne up. and Snowfall right, slowly on, moving up, moving. but, uh... Will it be enough in time? Muff is hit here on the road. Exoskeleton goes down as the INS squad from the south has just basically thrown itself into the side of the British force here. They split this squad up to try to wrap around, I suppose. Muff throwing GLs. All he can do now. To be the most effective right now is to just add as many GLs as he can in this direction. 
And INS now throwing smoke and it lands pretty much on Muff. You gotta be, you gotta be thinking that Muff is happy that they're just not throwing uh, frags. Because that would have been rolled right up to him nice and neat. Storm is actually like... So Storm's watching the angle to make sure no one comes around the side of the... Uh, GL lands close to Maverick. Not close enough to hit. And it's a and it's a in storm trade. We're getting just dudes break around the field. And Muff is gonna fall back here. One person against many don't work. Uh, but British have just run straight through. They're wrapping around the north side of the compound. They're gonna take the west compound first. Majority of INS forces are on this position, but they're still spread out so much. <sighs> British forces uh, from the south have now rejoined, just like the INS forces here. Uh, don't get shot, gets headshot right, over the uh, wall here. Right, Maybe a frag right. coming in. Here comes Imanaz. Will it bounce for Maverick? It goes too far. Fuck, that was a dumb aid. The second one actually gets a... Maverick catches a frag for it. Two dead. And he's gonna have to bandage here. I'm breaching. Yeah, I'll, I'll cover. Nihol's just watching the, uh, the north... Or watching his northeast here. He's got this road. But there's smoke. Oh, he would have seen Mighty Cross. And he kills Mighty as Mighty repeaks this to southwest. Inside that garage. Ooh, and the call is inside the Ooh, garage, but that. Silent knows better, I think. Uh, I'm out on edge. You have to put down your ammo. Uh, the British have actually wrapped around. They're clearing. They're clearing the compound from the west to the east. That was close. That was over that. That's actually tremendous. G-Man is uh, called out. Sebi's on a roof now. What the world? So the British now have an uh, elevated in. position. Help them out. Oh, no. Okay. So they're just going to help him clear. Cool. I'm pretty sure. Or maybe he's outside southeast. Yeah, I saw let's go, let's go. Mate, We got to clear this. We got to clear this. Make sure this is clear. Beef Baby takes shots at Kilo 9. A little bit more. He's right here. He's right here. He's right here. He's and right here. And Sebi has, has Sebi has G Man. Left side room. Left room. Left room. In the right. Holy shit, three. I'm gonna. Sebi gets hit, but G Man is also nice, there. I'm bandaging. That's east, guys east outside. And music. Right. Had help, now he's all alone here. You got him. And Beef Baby got medic, music there. And the British. <gasps> what is this? Garrett! Shoots Fisco in the back. Yeah, INS close. are in it's Alamo it's mode up. now. As they get driven off this uh, north yeah. northeast southwest road, Chicken and um, his buddy here, Limbs, are just holding off the point now. Garrett is the only other one on the point. I'm gonna get my, uh, can you put it back down? Uh, no, never mind, it's gone. They're RPGing, uh, yeah. folks. Limbs is RPGing, folks, down there. Okay. I'm gonna try and get on top of this. Yeah, I know. And Garrett is the last one on the point for uh, INS. Both of you go out and right when I. Now, go, 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 go. Sebi's up on the roof. And Sebi destroys Garrett. We're good. Alright, I'm hit. Medic, I'm coming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sebi has a bandage, though. Lucky for him. All right, and the British now secure the compound, so... Great Farm is 94% clear. It's up to Limbs and Chicken. Yeah. And I think Limbs and Chicken are just, uh... I think they're a little... I wonder if they're just isolated. They think they're... They have no way to get in, and it's... Kind of true. But not really. All right, Great Farm is clear. Good shit. They don't really have anyone looking towards them. 
But now with British clearing, what is this? Snowfall's still up. You lost. Your guys got flanked from the east side. Okay. So Snowfall actually makes it over here. Anyone else alive? It's just Snowfall, uh, Chicken and Limbs. Chicken and Limbs looks like they're about ready to make a break north. And Snowfall is just... I don't think these guys really have an angle to look at them. Maybe Dwarf could see them? But I don't think... Is Dwarf really looking this way? No, Dwarf's more looking west here. If uh, Snowfall starts shooting... Oh no, if... Uh oh. I'm gonna do something suicide. Alright. Snowfall gets more cover. <laughs> okay, Dorf is just gonna crawl through the field, so... Is this our final compound, or do we have to clear something yeah, else? Yeah, that's the final comp. Okay, so I can drop a radio? Oh, Snowfall's yeah, falling back to Chicken and Limbs. Sorry, I haven't... So, anything. crouch walking through the field, he yeah, might get spotted right. this berm right here. But Dorf is already prone. Uh, Imanaz and, uh, Frederick over here... Oh, Snowfall's smart, he goes prone here, so I don't think he's gonna get spotted. Um, Frederick's prone. He's going to prone all the way up to the field. So everyone's in the field and everyone's prone here. Um, so the UK, pretty strong here. They're going to have about a squad sized force defending the compound against three guys. Um, chicken and limbs are still holding position in the compound directly south. Snowfall's just crawling to make his way back here to regroup. But the British forces, they have their radio down. Mission accomplished, so now they're going to wait here for extraction. I'll watch radio. Cut. Actually, can you watch our west? Uh, that's kind of the same direction. Oh, all right. I mean, I can't really see west too well, but I can see the, the radio room. I can watch west if you can watch east. What is there right. an entrance on the southeast side of the comp? Yes. Dorf getting close here. Ooh. Snowfall just runs up and he gets into the compound. And I think Sebi just saw him? Question mark? Oh yeah, Sebi definitely saw them. Okay, I see. I'm gonna go Dorf, for they it. Might... Okay, I'm gonna- they're southwest, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure I saw a guy down there. I'll try and cover you. If they were smart, they'd run top and throw bombs. And here we go. Hey, you two, when you get your stamina back up, there's a sense entrance right up here. Get your stamina up, and you're fucking gonna run for it. Copy. I'm going now. Here goes Dorf. Ines have regrouped, but they're gonna take the- they're gonna take a western approach to the compound. Alright, three, go ahead. Eminaz, we're covering, you're good. Okay. Chicken limbs and snowfall. At least they're sticking together here. It's not an unreasonable path to take back, considering their alternative is to prone in the field and possibly get spotted. So they have about 100... They have about 200 meters to go before they get into contact again. But reasonably, they're going to start slowing down once they get to the west side of this compound. Because the compound is two sets, sort of divided by this main access road. And here comes, uh, here comes Chicken leading the charge for snowfall and limbs. Chicken only has a scorpion. Oh, buddy. They're pushing south to north. To my 250 and Frederick to saw him. To my Multiple infantry contacts, uh, three or more. Frederick saw all three of them and gave a contact report. That's brilliant. So the uh, British are going to be knowing that um, the INS are coming. They're just going to hold the eastern compound. 
INS beginning to come in. Now, does chicken have any frag rounds? It's still a tall order here. It's uh, 6v3. Here what it comes down to. Sebi on this roof here is just uh, a Beef, baby. Need a medic. clipping with the stairs here, Watch doing what you would normally do. Oh, just yeah, looking you around. Your command. Okay, I got it. Oh wait, no, you're not. Right. Limbs getting closer to the door as this snowfall. They're gonna start hearing movement. Chicken falling over here. Oh, are they gonna come up on the roof? Sebi might have a kill here. Oh, what a shot! Okay, bud. <laughs> Snowfall just domes Sebi. Limbs is out the door, and Dorf is now doing nothing but watching this door. This is it, boys. Oh, Dorf is actually gonna fall back. INS coming in. That's corner, me. Hold Everyone hold your fucking corner. Lego dude has himself a roof here. 3v5. Green doors, west doors, west doors. Limbs gets discovered by Beef Baby. Beef Baby's gonna hear uh, chicken and okay, limbs and snowfall around the side. Oh, Dwarf's gonna throw a grenade. <gasps> oh, nice that team. might actually get some. That gets limbs. You got him, you hit him. Chicken falls back to the... Oh. Wow, that was close. So, Scout tries to throw an IED down, but Beef Baby survives. Chicken's gonna run outside here. Along with, um, Snowfall. Snowfall gets shot at by Frederick, who's holding outside. And Chicken has to bandage. Snowfall's dead by Emanaz, so now it's or, now it's down to chicken, and uh, Dorf is gonna come up on the roof. It's gonna try to get over. Here. Uh, uh, chicken gonna push into Emanaz. Can he actually go? Oh yeah, he's gonna push. Killed one. Oh, Dorf just got him on the roof. That works too. That's it. GG. Uh, INS drops. British forces all the way down to five. Yeah, we got it. We got it. Great move here Unreal. Unreal. from British. Amazing job.